Hey guys, what is up? It is No Help, and welcome back to episode 15 of the league. So in this episode, we will be probably maxing. Maybe we'll have to see. It'd be we're very close to it. I feel like we could definitely max uh, sooner rather than later. We're about to hit 99 attack, and this is actually what we came for right here, the rune axe. Believe it or not, I need it for a hard clue that I was doing, and uh, yeah. So I guess we can go back to doing that clue now. But maybe we will get uh, 99 attack first. So yeah, if you guys like the video, make sure to smash the like button on with the video. And there we go, 99 attack. We have 125 points. We're going to swap this over to defense now. And the really good thing about 99 attack is I believe with the skill cape, maybe it's just having 99 attack. I can actually enter the warrior's guild or whatever the guild is to get the dragon defender, which we still don't have. Um, so yeah, we'll have to go ahead and do that at some point just for the points really I can't see myself getting rid of the bandos book unless I go ahead and get like a thing from the clue scrolls So we're just off. Uh, I thought I needed the rune axe It's apparently actually the rune boots that I need so I guess we'll still be here for a little while And uh, I guess all we have left is really is uh rain or range defense and prayer and then we'll be maxed combat so yeah, looking really forward to it. We're 836k from 99 Slayer, which should be really good as well. So, yeah. Oh, brother. Second Necreal task, and we finally get these stupid room boots. Okay, cool. Um, Now, there's two ways that I could go ahead and get the Mystic Fire Staff. I could go to Hydra and get it from Hydra. And I thought about I thought about this. Uh, hold Might hold uh, against me for this, but can I... Kill Hydra with a crystal bow. Because I, I don't want to go into Hydra without the fourth uh, Bando's item. So I think I'm going to go ahead and just try. You know what I mean? Worst case scenario, it doesn't work. And then we have to do Scorpion Catcher. Oh, you love to see it. We got the Fire Staff and the Mystic. Uh, uh, milling Hydra isn't actually so bad at all. I think uh, it's better than range for me now anyways, because we got the Hasta. So let's just knock this out. All right, so we actually get the Dopamine Rush now. We've got the five hard caskets, like I said, and four mediums. So what are we hoping for? So let's go ahead with the mediums first. First medium, Pink Boater. Second medium, we got some Teleports. Okay, it's a unique. What the hell is that? And we got a master clue. What is this bell? It's just a unique item. We got the boater. Alright, time for the more exciting kind of shit. We have cards. Let's go. First one. Nothing. And a 25 point assignment to open a hard casket. Oh my god, nothing at all. Purple sweets. I think it's an assignment as well to actually eat the purple sweets. Let's go ahead and do that. Yep, that's a five point kind of a task. We're not getting lucky here at all. Let's just go ahead and dump this shit in here. Ah, oh, this sucks, man. Let's go. Ooh, we got ancient crazy ears. I don't think that's like a bandos item by any means, but uh, last chance. Holy shit honorable bless no no way that just happened that is so unlucky that could have been no bro that literally could have been um gilded or ah, oh, dude no all right so we're gonna do a couple of the easy clues as well uh i might end up just not giving up, but uh, waiting to get this Bandos item um, because yeah, I just can't be fucked to do clue scrolls anymore tonight. And I think at that rate, we are going to be dropping this uh, easy clue scroll. All right, this is going to be the last hard clue until we get the house upgrades, I think, just to make it easier to get around the game. Nothing. A red fucking cavalier, man. You hate to see this shit. All right, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure using a fire lighter... How the fuck do you do this? Do you have to use it on the log? Like, I'm really confused. Um, I've never done this in the entire game. Uh, I just need a log, I guess. Um, just get a log. Do I just use that on this? Oh, you tan it first. And then you burn it, and I think that should be a task. Yep, just a five-pointer. <laughs> what the fuck, man? 4 KCS all row. We got the magic fang. 
yep, that's an upgrade. 125 point task for creating a toxic trident. And I guess we gotta charge this bad boy up. I did not expect to get this like right away pretty much. Uh, okay, cool. I guess we need to charge it. So let's just get all the runes that we need. I think we need chaos, death, right? Chaos, chaos, death, and know, is it... What the hell, Siri? Okay, how's a Google Home? Um, death runes. Uh, or no, we need GP, right? Um, where the hell's my money? I haven't actually charged one of these bad boys in a while. Do I just like use that on it? Um, oh, do we need? I think we need Zalra scales as well, actually. Okay, so we got some charges in it. <laughs> what brother we got all of the uniques i'm just kidding we just need the blowpipe and uh you know if we can get the uh 10 antidotes before that that, that, that would be cool now is the, i'm pretty sure like this if i just use like zalra scales on it um we could use it here oh and that's another 125 point assignment as well so we just need the blowpipe man and uh yeah, we're looking like we actually, like, kill Zal right now. Because <laughs> we'll move the Slayer Helm down. Is the Slayer Helm better? I guess it has more of a magic attack bonus. But, uh, yeah, because we have Venom Master on anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, so let's go ahead and just either get the Blowpipe, which would be fucking nice, or, um... It's like a 1 in 42 or something like that, so we've, we've honestly been really lucky. I just want the 10, like, antidotes so that I can go ahead and actually build my house, so... It's always been nice, man. I'm going to show you guys a quick kill. Like, this is how easy it is. Um, You just run around here like this with the knife's edge and stuff like that. And uh, obviously, the Zamoroks, you're just hitting like crazy. It's just insane. So, let's see what he puts on next. So, for the melee, you know, you just walk up here. Hopefully, get a hit in there. Run down. Hopefully, get a hit in. And then the next one's going to be magic. Magic, he sometimes does damage to you, which it honestly at this point doesn't really matter for me. I want my HP to be lower. Might honestly run in some poison to make it a bit lower. And uh, then we come up to here for his range phase. Solar is just so easy, man, on the leagues. Like, I'm getting like 10 kill trips, so I'm obviously going to just use the Zolar Andra teleports. There's no point in using last recall at this point. And what ma magic next? So I guess we'll see. Look, I'm fucking up really bad on just on purpose, really, to uh, just make my knife's edge better. I think my like kill, like my best kill, was like a minute thirty. So honestly, not too bad at all. Thank you for hitting me more, sir. So we can hit you higher on your next phase. And then where are you coming next? Right here. Run down. And absolute unit's really good here because it just like it's basically like one of those rings. It just destroys all the minions. And he should be dead here, maybe. It's pretty pretty easy. <laughs> oh man. I'm actually excited to go back to Zora on my regular Iron Man too. The league has got me really wanting to do just bossing on the main game. Like a lot, like crazy. Uh, I'm really excited to actually just finish up maxing on the main game now and just actually just I really want to do Vorkath and just Solra and just a bunch of other bosses like on the main game it's just it's bossing on this game is just so much fun and so like rewarding too right and I think he should be dead here right before the Jad phase yep and let's see let's see if we get another kill oh dude that's actually the one I wanted the antidotes because now i can i think now i can do the upgrade to my house i'll finish this trip off um see what we can if you know we can pull the blowpipe in like less than 25 kc okay i think it's finally time we can start building this pool thank you to zalra so let's go ahead and build the first tier what am i missing oh i need five buckets of fucking water all right jx so hopefully you let me build this goddamn pool now we got the first pool, and then to upgrade it, what the hell do we need? Stamina potions, and then 10 prayer potions, and then 10 super restores. 
Oh my god, we need marble blocks and a gold leaf. I'm gonna have to wait half an hour for the fucking teleport. Okay, that was a half an hour of hell trying to get the mushroom caps from the stupid trees in Fossil Island. But anyways, we should... <laughs> anyways, with the watering can, we should now be able to make... Oh, you love to see it, the fairing in the house, and now we just need to get the upgrades for this. Time to spend, like, the entire pretty much bank that I've made off of Slayer. So I actually need eight leaves and three of the marble blocks. So one, two, three. Holy shit, that was already how much? These are 300k each, and then we need five, six, seven, eight. Okay, these are a lot cheaper, and then these, we eventually need to get 25 of them. Holy shit, man. <laughs> Alright, we can make the house upgrades. It's about fucking time. Well, boys, it turns out we do not even have enough Renars to make the house upgrades. You absolutely hate to see this. Oh my god, this is so fucking cringe. Anyways, I guess we're gonna go ahead and plant this uh, Renara seed, the one that we have, and pray to god that it does not die. And then in an hour, we will finally make these stupid house upgrades that we've been needing to do. <laughs> this sucks. And there we go, 99 Slayer has been achieved on the Elise account at 13kc on alchemical hydra you love to see it man we're just stacking up the bones now for prayer as well we're actually getting a decent amount of prayer xp here as well so uh i'm actually right now just waiting on my herb to grow for farming to do the house upgrades so we're just gonna you know kill some uh, hydra all right, so well, we got that 125 point task for killing Hydra 25 times. I think it's about time now we upgrade the pool. We can do the rejuvenation pool and then upgrade it again to the full on rejuvenation pool. What is the next upgrade? We need 10 super restores and two marble blocks. Okay, and here we go with the fancy rejuvenation. And what's the next one that we need? We need the 10 anti venoms. The, um, the five gold leaves and the a thousand blood roots. Okay, another upgrade I want to make is the cape hanger. And then we can go ahead and put the crafting cape on here. But now all I'm going to need... Oh, you need the hood. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me, man? All right, now we have the crafting cape here. So we can just use the construction cape now. And then we have an immediate teleport right to the bank. Ooh, 19k herbalore and the anti-venoms. Okay, I think we can do it now. Build the rejuvenation pool. So now all we have to do is teleport to our POH. And right when we enter the POH, we're going to have the crafting cave and the rejuvenation pool, which we can just sip, get full restore stats, and then quickly teleport to a bank. Oh, dude, this changes everything, man. We've got a fairy ring there, too. We're going to build the box. Um, This might be the level. Oh, we're not there yet. Here we go, 93 agility it is no longer our lowest skill. <laughs> We're going to just pump this out. We just need to do uh, the rest of agility, um, which we might end up finishing tomorrow. And then the last little bit of Slayer and stuff like that. I guess Slayer's done, but the last little bit of combat. And I'm, I'm really more so worried about prayer than the other ones. But I, like I said, I can just do Hydra. And even if I have to use range at Hydra, we'll, we'll get it done. 50 hydras completed still nothing really worth noting but uh it's not going too bad we're sitting at 94 range okay we got an identified fragment and it of course means literally nothing because apparently we already have a fragment here oh my god we're at 62 kc at hydra now nothing really to talk about we are at 95 range i really want to do melee hydra but i feel like i should just do range you know what i mean because we're uh we need a max anyways so it's not going too too bad here it's bearable at least you know what i mean so we're able to get like at least 10 kill trips more than that probably depending on if i fuck up the prayers or something like that but uh very very simple to do hydra i'm really excited to just go back to hydra on the main game i can't wait to get back into it but uh yeah for now we grind on the leaks 
All right, so we're switching to a little bit of melee hydra. Um, we should be actually getting 99 defense here. Uh, melee hydra is actually a lot better than range, even without the Bandosian thing. It's just it, you hit so incredibly high all the time. It's ab absolutely just crazy and insane. Um, oh, we're gonna get hit here. I don't even know which tick we're on at this point, but uh, uh, there we go. Uh, don't die here, sir. There we go. 99. Defense has been achieved on the leagues 125 points and we're almost uh, the next combat level is too So there is a dragon battle axe drop 68 KC. That was a new personal best Omega oh, law hydra tail. I don't know if if uh, That's everything we need or I don't even know. I don't even know what that's for to be honest. Oh, is that for the bone crusher thing from Vorkath? Anyways, we're 1kc away from another task. 125 points for killing Hydra 75 times. I believe there is a 250 and a 300kc one too. So I'll probably knock that out to be completely honest. Not now, but in a little bit. We might have enough bones, honestly, at this point to just get 99. Probably not. Oh, I guess that means we have all of the uniques from Hydra. Can we go ahead and make the ring? Ah, uh, Hydra's heart. Proceed with the combination. And if we wear a brimstone ring, that is 125 points. Now, what does this do? Because I actually could probably make this on the main game, too. Cool. It's, it's actually good. It's a hybrid ring with a 4 melee strength bonus. Yeah, I dig it. Considering we were wearing the 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 ring of wealth <laughs> before this uh that's an upgrade all right so i'm getting like 4k prayer drops per and this guy right here is really funny if i go to put my public on he says all three protection prayers it looks like we don't trust each other look at us we're all wearing different <laughs> protection prayers that's really funny um oh yeah i never even thought this would be a great way to like level up fragments but i, I guess at this point it doesn't really matter for me i mean it probably does somewhat i know there's a task for completing all of the fragments but uh yeah, we got another 158 bones this is a lot more xp than i was i guess thinking we'd get i don't i don't it's not like we're gonna get 99 out of this but uh we're about to get a decent level here if we just use the next bone and the next bone there we go 95 prayer so we are three prayer levels away from max combat all right guys so i think the video has actually gone on long enough and a hundred percent in the next video we will be maxing i've got range prayer and agility left and that is absolutely it for maxing so my plans are i know it's faster to do melee at hydra but i want to knock out as many hydra kills as i possibly can so i think i'm going to just stick with range for a little bit at hydra we'll probably get like 100 maybe 110 something like that kc by the time we hit 99 range it's fairly slow like i'm averaging i shouldn't say slow it's about 1.5 mil range an hour and i'm only getting about 120k prayer an hour but the they do drop the dragon bones uh hydra drops a lot of the dragon bones so i'm gonna probably just camp here until i get 99 range and then we'll probably switch back to melee to finish off hydra and get the bones that way just because melee is a lot faster and then tonight we will go to train some agility and maybe get 99 either tonight or tomorrow but i'm having a lot of fun at hydra and just with all of these fragments and things like that it's awesome and who knows we could get extremely lucky and get the lance that would be ideal and there also is a task for completing 100 and then 250 and 300 so i guess i will go for those um i do i would rather much rather kill hydra on the main game but uh uh, for now it's not too bad so yeah thank you guys so much for watching the video today and uh yeah the next one we will be maxing so it's going to be some exciting and fun stuff so yeah thank you guys so much for watching the video today if you went ahead and comment or watch the whole video go ahead and comment red down below thank you guys so much and i will see you in the next one